Hi Planner friends, I'm back with another video and this is a flip of my Hobonichi Weeks book journal and I'm surprised because the um, lighting is actually quite good but it comes off very dark here. So yeah, I hope you can still see it well and it is still fine for you. Or oh, let me just try and change the location. Okay, I have changed um, to my bed. It's not better, uh, it is better. <clears throat> not much but it's better it just comes off everything comes off so dark it's really strange sometimes so this is my book journal i really wanted um like usually i always have a book journal and it doesn't have to be a day planner but um i needed a mega weeks as my main planner that i'm not really much using now but um i wanted to, to have this very beautiful um Hobonichi regular weeks and I thought I can do my book journal so actually here in the front I'm not using any of that also the tracker before I wanted to do like um like maybe how many pages a day I'm reading but this is not going to happen so I also thought maybe in like in a retrospective I will put in the books I have read but let's see how that goes um, I am using the monthly, um, so I always put the book and when I have started it. So I put the book and then I draw a line till I finish it, then I put the next book and um, yeah, then you can see how long I need it for one book. It also depends um, on the pages and it also depends on the time I have. I decorated this very minimally. And then here you can see I was reading two books at the same time, which can also happen. I'm still reading two books at the same time. And now I've started this and it's really not that easy. So I always use one color and I just um, kind of draw the line to see how long I am reading it. Uh, and then I do something similar here. So I start a book, I use a color and then I mark it here how long I need it. Um, to read the book and then here I put the small kind of um, review um, just to remind myself what it was about I want to read 52 books so one book per week and then I think it's nice to just be able to look back and maybe if I don't have um, a direct idea of idea of what the book was about then I can come here and just quickly read a few things about it I drew some decorations here and there and then here I started the next one um, and I use all um, of the pages even though I have just like I have already finished it no I I even finished it here but um, this one I have started it here I didn't have as much to write about and I <clears throat> I finished it here but I have put um, the review here and then I started the book um, and this one I didn't even start in this week. I started it here but I put it here because this one I finish it later. So I hope this is not confusing but um, yeah. Then here um, you can see I'm reading two books at the same time and then I haven't used any colors yet so I still have to do this. And then here uh, here we are currently, this is today, the end of February almost, and here will be my next book. So I also have an index here in the back um, where I put all the things and first, um, and like initially I wanted to do the uh, book reviews here and maybe I will still do a kind of collection here at the back if I have time. I will just probably copy from the week section and put it here. And um, yeah, I think it's really cool to see kind of how, when I'm reading what and how long. And I think it's cool for me to look back at it and also that it's dated is also kind of nice because usually I do not have like I do remember sometimes when I see a book I remember oh I read this book in summer or in winter sometimes I see myself sitting um close to the heater or the oven and just um reading a, a, sp a sp specific book that I'm remembering but here I really have or this one I was reading the main part of it in a coffee shop because 
one of my goals for 2023 was or is to take myself out on dates alone um, more often and I do that now or I have done that in January and I was just sitting in the coffee shop reading that book so I kind of remember but here I can really definitely see when I was reading it and I do have on my phone which is I used to record this I have the Goodreads app so I do um, also track my progress there and now I'm going to uh, sit down and go in with the colors and um, yeah so this is actually my book um, journal and I really like it I love that I can use it and I also love the cover this is just like sitting at home or if I go away for longer then I will take it with me but the cover is from uh, Pidori Vienna I have uh, mentioned it before I don't know if she I think the shop is still open but not very often but it's a very soft and beautiful letter and I also love how it is just like everything fits so well together I also love my setup in here which is quite similar to my planner Hobony two weeks and I love how simple it is it doesn't stress me out at all I just come here if I finish a book I just write down when I've started it and and yeah so um this is actually really nice um yeah so that's my book journal thanks for watching guys and see you in my next video bye